is truly some of the most spectacular art that man has to offer. What you're seeing is this is all silk embroidered, and it comes from a province in China called Suzhou. And this art has been being done for over 2,000 years. There are families that were put there by the emperor to embroider his robes. And these families have developed incredible techniques and skills and, and talent to produce some of man's finest art. Let's take a look and I'll show you how this has been done. What they do is they'll take all the silkworms, they put them in these baskets and feed them on mulberry leaves. Once the silkworms have matured, they spin into a cocoon. They can get about 2,000 feet out of one cocoon of that very, very fine fiber. This is thinner than a human hair. They'll split the thread down to a, a specific count of the thread itself. The thread starts with a total of 16 strands. Depending upon the quality of the piece, they will determine how many strands they use to actually do the work. Is it a top quality piece that you're looking at here, they will use one to four strands to actually stitch it. These top quality pieces will take anywhere from months to years to complete. When they go to stitch it, one of the key elements is to make sure that the knots don't show. Now first, the knots are going to be extremely small. As he cuts it, the knots are on the bottom side. As he cuts it, the silk fabric locks down on it and holds it in position to give you this incredibly lovely finish. So if we look, for example, at the back of one piece, and here you can actually see that how lovely it actually is. And if you were to rub your hands over it, you can actually feel the little knots. This is actually one of the key elements to tell you that this has actually been stitched by hand. So in fact, if you turn it over, and there's the front. Absolutely wonderful.